Hi guys, it's me Justine and today I am going to be talking about my favorite Disneyland rides. I went to Disneyland in September, I've talked about it in a few videos and I just loved it there so much and I had the chance to go on most of the rides. There's a few rides that I didn't go on because they were either closed or I was too afraid but next time I go I'm gonna try to go on the ones I didn't go on. So the ones I didn't go on won't be in my top 10 list of favorite Disney rides like California Screaming because I didn't go on that and Space Mountain and Thunder Mountain Railroad. Those are I think the three main, oh and Soaring Over California, I didn't go on any of those so those won't be in my top 10. So anyway, I'm gonna go through my favorite rides that I would recommend you guys going on if you go to Disneyland. My number 10 ride is the Finding Nemo Submarine. That ride is really cool and it felt like you were actually in a submarine. It was really neat and it went, it felt like you were like going down like in, in the water. It showed basically the whole Finding Nemo story and you got to see all the characters and yeah it was really cool but it was a really long ride like it just seemed to go on forever. That's good too that it's long because you get more of the experience so yeah I really enjoyed that ride but some people might not like it because it's kind of like you're in a submarine it's squished I guess but I didn't find it that bad so yeah. My number nine uh, ride to go on is Toy Story Mania. That ride was really fun. I remember waiting quite a while to get on that ride. It was basically like an arcade game thing. Like we got to shoot different things and there was like big, big screens and you could shoot things on the screen and try to beat your friend or whoever you're with. I remember it felt like things were coming at you too, like they'd blow air at you and stuff and it felt like I was getting gonna get hit with a plate or something. Yeah, it was really cool and really fun, like I didn't expect it to be like that. It was like 3D, we had to wear glasses and yeah, it was really different. Number eight is The Haunted Mansion. I loved The Haunted Mansion movie. I remember always looking forward to seeing it on Halloween and yeah the ride was just so cool. I went uh, around Halloween time so the ride was themed with the Nightmare Before Christmas stuff as well as the Haunted Mansion movie stuff in the ride so that was really cool that we got to see that. Yeah but I would have liked that ride to have more Haunted Mansion themed stuff though because there wasn't much other than the like the was it like a ball or no the lady's head yeah in a ball thing I think it was like floating no I don't really remember I have a clear memory of that but it was still a very cool ride and scary and yeah and the mansion itself like just looking at it from the from outside is very cool looking my number seven goofy sky school it's like a mini roller coaster thing and I wasn't expecting to like love it that much <laughs> but I did it was really fun I went on it with my dad and felt like you were gonna fall off it was kind of like rickety I don't know but I really enjoyed it my number six favorite ride is one that isn't available someone is facetiming me right now and I'm not gonna answer and they're gonna get mad at me <laughs> sorry Kendra <laughs> no my number six favorite ride is the Tower of Terror which isn't technically at Disneyland anymore because they replaced it with Guardians of the Galaxy but it's still the same concept where you go up really high and then you drop and you drop drop a few times and <laughs> she's facetiming me again. Yeah that ride was really scary but like I really enjoyed it and I've had so many dreams about that ride like just dropping <laughs> but yeah it was kind of hard to breathe on that ride like I was going like <sighs> like the whole time we were dropping but like I love that about it. I love the like adrenaline and stuff. Number five is Splash Mountain. I really liked Splash Mountain. Just like waiting for that drop was like really crazy for me. Like I remember my heart was like going crazy because I didn't know how high the drop was. But then after going on it one time I was like oh I have to go again. So I went again. That was one of the only rides that I went on twice I think and 
yeah, I could have done it like so many times. I just love the drop part. You get pretty wet on that ride sometimes. I remember there was a girl in the very front who was like freaking out because she was getting so wet. <laughs> so that's one of the things that isn't so good about the ride, but it's also fun when you get wet sometimes too. Number four is Star Tours, which is a Star Wars ride. And that ride was so cool. I can't remember if we had to wear glasses for it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we did. And it looked like you were like in a spaceship and you were seeing the characters from the show and I remember one of them like came up on the windshield because we were in the spaceship and it splat came on the windshield and freaked me out and that was a really cool ride. Like it felt so real. Number three is a ride that I didn't know existed before I went to Disneyland. Like I had searched the rides but I never saw this one and it was the riverboat ride. Grizzly River Run. That's it. Yeah that ride was so much fun. You get quite wet on that ride too but um you're just in this big like raft and you're just you know rafting <laughs> in, in the raft <laughs> and um you're with a few other people. It's quite big and there's a bunch of drops or like three drops I think and you like spin as you're dropping and I remember I was like backwards, like going down the drop backwards <laughs> a few of the times I went on and it was really fun. <laughs> it was just a really fun ride. I, I love that ride. <laughs> Number two is the Cars ride. That ride was just incredible, like <laughs> so cool. Like when you go inside you get to see all the characters from the show, like just right there, all the big cars. and. You get your car all cleaned up at Luigi's, I think it was, and then you race against another car, and you go so fast, like, ugh, it's so cool. I only went on that ride once, but I could have done it, yeah, so many times. That is a must if you go to Disneyland to go on the Cars ride. That is in the California Adventure Park. My number one favorite ride was Indiana Jones, <laughs> which I, actually I did kind of, I had watched some videos on it, I think. And uh, actually, no, I didn't. But I just had a feeling it might be my favorite ride. Because I remember, I think I talked to someone and they said it was their favorite. And I was like, well, it must be good. It was really fast. And you see, like, Indiana Jones coming off this rope above you. And it looks real. Like, I actually thought it was Harrison Ford for a second. But, <laughs> but it wasn't, because that would be kind of weird if he was just there every single day. There's this really, like, scary part on that ride where this big ball, I can't remember what you call them, but it's big balls coming at you and, and then you go down, you just drop and oh, th that part was so fun. So if you go to Disneyland, I would definitely recommend going on all those rides. I hope you enjoyed this video, I hope it helped you if you're going to Disneyland and want to know the best rides, in my opinion. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe if you haven't already. So yeah, I hope you guys have an amazing day. Bye.